News on the Go. It is 7.53. Here's your news on the go. Today marks one week since that deadly crash in the town of Granby. Fulton Jr. Riley Bartlett was killed in the crash. Her boyfriend, 16-year-old Brady Niver, is still in the hospital this morning. Brady's mom just posting to Facebook, hoping that the community's continued prayers will help him pull through. The other couple involved in the crash is still in the hospital as well. Fred and Sharon Strickland are expected to survive, but they have their own serious injuries and will need weeks of rehab. The Oswego County Sheriff's Office says Riley crossed over the center line on State Route Route 48 last Sunday, hitting the Strickland's minivan. Deputies are continuing to investigate the cause of the crash. Mother's Day is just one week away, and in honor of the special holiday, the CNY Diaper Bank is holding its eighth annual Make a Mother's Day Diaper Drive. The goal is to collect 50,000 diapers by the end of the month, so the drive is happening all month long for you to donate. All of the funds will go toward diaper purchases to support local families in need. It's almost time for runners to take their mark. The Mountain Goat Run is in just under an hour at this point. Participants are going to run a 10-mile course across some of the hardest hills in the heart of the city. The 45th annual Mountain Goat Run starts at 915 along South Salina Street downtown. And if you are heading downtown to watch or run the race, be aware today's special race is going to cause for some traffic changes. West Water Street is now a two-way, and parts of Erie Boulevard, West and Clinton Street are going to close. There are other partial road closures, so runners can safely pass through all of the city of Syracuse. And we'll have a full list of what those closures are posted at localsyr.com. It is 7.55. Carson's back with a look at our final forecast. Hey, Carson. That's right. Good morning, once again, Adrian, great looking weather this morning for the runners out there doing the mountain go tower cam overlooking downtown Syracuse run final time. Good deal of blue sky, good deal of sunshine right now. Those bright skies not going to last all day long. We'll talk about that in a second. Current temperature in Syracuse 45 degrees, light east wind at about three miles per hour. Some of the other temperatures across the region warming up quickly with all that sunshine this morning into the 40s to right around or just above 50 degrees, about 45 again here in Syracuse, 50 in Skinny Atlas, 41 degrees right now. In in Cortland. Radar screen all quiet here in Syracuse and across central New York, but clouds will be on the increase though as we go through this morning, kind of filtering that sunshine and kind of covering up the sun altogether. Later on today, highs getting up into the 60s to right around or just above 70 despite the increase in cloud cover and some of those rain chances building in. We're back to mostly sunny skies, highs within a couple degrees of 70 tomorrow, slightly cooler but seasonable Tuesday with sun and clouds. Rain chances staying remarkably low here over the next several days. Lots of sunshine here Wednesday and Thursday with highs in the low 70s. Really comfortable conditions, Adriana, right through the end of the week. Highs getting back into the mid 70s with intervals of clouds and sunshine looking toward Friday and Saturday. Just a beautiful looking yeah. forecast and we deserve it after all the we rain We have been waiting for this weather. Yes. This weather is beautiful. It the is. seven day forecast, I'll take it. Yeah, absolutely. All those out there, I'm sure we'll take it yeah, as happy well. Happy to deliver some good news yes, from the weather department Carson. always. <laughs> Carson bringing in the good news and to the Mountain Goat Runners today, yes. we hope you run safe to the News Channel Niners running today. Good luck. We are rooting for you. And for news and weather anytime, of course, be sure to download the News Channel 9 app. Our next update is at 827. We hope you have a great day, everyone.